Okay, so we're going to apply texture on your templates. But before that, maybe you want to put some finery touch on your templates. But for the purpose of this, uh, showing you the basic learning of doing clothing, uh, this is sufficient enough, I guess. So open up your choice of fabric uh, texture. You can it can be uh, handwritten by you, or you can download somewhere from the website. It's up to you. As usual, select all copy and paste to your template okay as you can see this fabric um, doesn't cover all your templates if you want to do it bigger it doesn't make sense because the texture will look like you know it is not realistic no texture, you won't wear something like this. So, since you don't want to make your um, tank texture look so big, what I do is that I will copy all this um, the texture itself and paste it like this. So, I keep on copying the original uh, layer of the texture until it's cover all the templates. So when you do the duplicate of the fabric, it seems that you can see this kind of line here and this is not good, but you can erase it with um, eraser. Now finish with the duplicating, now you want to merge the layers. Merge layers. Okay. Now this is the fun part. All you see now is the black fabrics, right? Okay, now we go to the over layer. Select now it's normal uh, view. You go to overlay and tada you can see you can still see the wrinkles, the brace, uh, the chest shadows you want to mold it as according to your templates what you do is that highlight the fabric layer and then press ctrl c t r l ctrl and click to your templates layer okay you see the body of your templates has been highlighted what you do is that go to copy merge and then just paste it okay now click the eyes so that uh, make the other layers invisible so now you have a template with the fabric the texture on it and again you can put a final retouch on it uh, on your um, fabric it's up to you um, But I think it's. I don't want to go further on that. Um, so now we have the texture itself. Now, what we're going to do is how to save it. Alright. So, what we're going to do now is to save um, your templates here uh, to TGA. But before that, uh, we have to make this part invisible in the channels what we go how we're going to do it is control and click your templates go to channels save selection of channels this will make the part which is black will be invisible to your avatar body save your file as DGA <coughs> All right. 32 bits that should be good ok now you want to see how your clothes look like you still can play around with your templates make uh, it a um, bit more creative now let's open up CLP and see how yours will look like 